There's a great woundedness in our communities, and every community is facing this. As a chaplain for the Ventura County Fire Department, Realtor Kay Wilson Bolton experienced a call that compelled her to stand up for the homeless in her town of Santa Paula, California. Christmas Eve morning, 2008, I was on a call for a homeless man who had died in one of our churches. What followed that was an awareness of what was going on in my community and something I was not aware of, and as it turned out, hardly anybody was, and we decided to do something about that. So we started with a meal, which began two weeks later, and I remember standing in the church that night and just wondering if anybody would come, and so they did, and I started walking them it's still kind of emotional to remember watching them walk towards us, knowing that we had something they needed and were actually willing to offer it. And offer it we did. That first meal served 57 people. Today, the spirit of Santa Paula's Many Meals program serves 600 meals every Wednesday in a local church. We have about 50 volunteers through the day that make this happen. And we have a fabulous food pantry where people who come in can take food supplies home. The program has grown to include a drop-in center for the homeless that is open daily and is run out of the back of Kay's office. The front 1,500 square feet is for real estate and then the back 1,500 square feet is perfect for the work of Spirit at Santa Paula, which includes a kitchen, dining room, but it's just a whole service that we provide that's more like family. It's a struggle for every homeless person that's out here, but Kay always has a door open for them and always waiting for them. The bottom line of what we try to do is give them hope and give them a touch of humanity and grace and mercy. People out on the street know I can always be forgiven and I can always get a warm meal and a smile at Kay's. And that, that really goes far. I was hungry. I was homeless. She started helping me out, just build myself up. If it wasn't for her, I don't think I'd be where I'm at right now. I have a job, I'm a supervisor. It's beautiful. Kay put so much trust in me and so much love and so much faith. She doesn't just open her heart, you know, she opened her office to me and you start to rebuild yourself. Being with her, it gave me an opportunity to, to grow up. And I became a member of this church. I'm a deacon here now, and it's a whole different world. It's a beautiful world. We help them by building some self-confidence, knowing that when they walk back in the door, somebody's gonna be glad to see them. Kay is probably the most forgiving person I've ever met. She wakes up every day and loves the world again. My goal is to be that warm fire that people are drawn to. Giving the homeless a face to show, hey, these are just people, their mothers, fathers, brothers, uncles, aunts. Too often, they are the forgotten. Spirit of Santa Paulo, people like Kay, they're not gonna let them be forgotten.